Argo haters and Trump coming to the rescue. But first in the buzz, some of Hollywood's top celebrities have had their most personal information shared online. A website has published private financial information, social security numbers, and credit reports of various celebs like Ashton Kutcher, Jay-Z, Paris Hilton, and Mel Gibson, among many others. Hillary Clinton and Vice President Joe Biden were also hacked, though not as thoroughly. The website reportedly posted their addresses, but no credit reports. The LAPD is investigating. The FBI says they are aware, but will neither confirm nor deny the existence of an investigation. And we know the Academy loved the movie Argo, but the country of Iran did not. The Oscar Best Picture winner is getting sued by Iran for an unrealistic portrayal of the Islamic State. According to reports, Iranian officials are deciding how and where to file the lawsuit. And could Donald Trump be coming to the rescue of the United States? Due to sequestration, the White House has scrapped tours, and many people were upset about it. Newt Gingrich has suggested that Trump could pay for the tours at the White House. Donald says if they wanted to do something like that, he'd be open to it, and he thinks it's a shame the tours of the White House are no more. The tycoon would need to dish $2 million over the next seven months to cover the cost of the tours. And Monday night was full of magic on the red carpet as it was the premiere of the incredible Burt Wonderstone. Celebrities and comedians all came out to be part of the affair. The new comedy stars Steve Carell, Jim Carrey, and Steve Buscemi, all magicians on the Las Vegas Strip competing against each other to be the best. The movie also stars Olivia Wilde who shared a secret about the hair Jim Carrey sports in the film. It's really long. It looks really horrible if you haven't seen the trailer for it yet. She says Jim chose that wig for his character and it was actually a wig they had left out for her to try, but he picked it up and said he could work it. The incredible Burt Wonderstone hits theaters this Friday. And a former ABBA member, Agnetha Faltzkog, is releasing her first album in nearly a decade. The 62-year-old's new single, When You Really Love Someone, is out today. The full album will be released May 13th. And the competition's heating up on the Idol stage. There are only 10 contestants left battling out to win. The final decision is now in America's hands. Tonight, the contestants will pay tribute to past Idol winners. So be sure to tune in right here on Fox 31 at 8 p.m. And that's your buzz for today.